Wait, wait. Can I pause? Can't pause. The hell? What took you so long? Do you have any idea how long? Okay. Sorry, but if you want an excuse, I went to the fashion life on security. Having to go patrol every night puts me on edge sometimes. So, where is the air in your hands? Out of battery. Useless. Can you put your change? Huh, <laughs> whatever. Let's be quick this time. We don't like usual. I'm going ahead. We both know what will happen if you like it. Don't call me useless, man. We're close enough for you to act like my boss, Carol Mc... Carol McDonald. Uh, I can't read that. There you go. Yeah. Next time, make sure I cannot hear you bad mouthing me. I can't do that. Wait, is all character sank? Oh, I can save too. It's a point and click. God damn. Well, not point and click. More like click to move. Okay. The door's lock. I said something became when the guy set foot to the school. He seemed to know what that was. What you looking at? I should have never come here. I should shoot the killer and get it get us out of here as soon as possible. What's that crack? The door slow. God is cold. Hmm? The door is not locked. Then go inside. Oh, the, the light's flickering right then. The light's flickering. He heard glass breaking. He came from the nearby classroom. He tried to convince Sam himself that that, that that was his companion's brain. Why? To suppress his fear, maybe? Kayla? Oh, is that you? Or. Here I come. Prepare yourself. Prepare yourself. Shall I be going over here? No? Okay, over here then. I don't even know what this is. Um, No, nah, no. Nah. Piece of paper. Where where you are standing? Okay. No, no. Damn. What is this? I'm stuck. Alright, I just fixed that problem. For some reason, the load menu just keep appearing. Oh, here I come. Prepare. Prepare yourself. Is it on this one? Oh, it is, okay. Kayla, stop pausing around. I know it's you. This be you. I'm so tired of this. And he walk on, on and on with all the fuels running wild in his head. Until he saw the window. A rock. Who's who the rock? 
a stone wait help help someone's behind the wall I, I must get killed right now they did not know if it was a out of fear or something else but he ran like hell if something terrible was about to happen Well, I can't move really. I scream and force him in fear. For some reason, he cannot get hit. Even though he knew fear had lost. Let's go. Let's go. I need to go here. Nope, I need to go up there. A broken bulb. Everything in this school is freaking in. Exit. What? Kira. What's going on? These stairs. When I first came for here, he and I can't. The stairs for fun. 12 steps. 1. 2. 2 D. Then something strange happened, but that was far from the strangers. Impossible. When they when they were only 12 steps, he ignored it and continued to look for his friend. But the moment he got down from the 30th step, what is it? The light stack on. You know something bad about to happen. She won't be long gone by now. She go home too because I think I saw. Oh shit. Oh hey. Nobody knew what was happening yet, but everyone felt the need to escape as soon as possible, even me. This cool love somehow felt sinister and suffocating. Sometimes it was too stubbornly that silent. The tail floating around only made things worse. I know, I know, I should have moved side elsewhere. However, things were not so simple. I cannot really describe it, it just felt so close to me. No, it's not nostalgia or familiarity. It's so weird how after all this, I still can, don't get that feeling. One day, all they could have happened. Oh, I always don't know when I recall that feeling. But you will know what's happening to me soon enough. Chapter 2 The Musical Sometime later, two students started, feeling, started telling a new story, as if telling each other's rumor was a school tradition. This story is about a girl who was on the school grounds on one night. They said something was there in the music room. Something that was waiting for the girl to open the door and step inside. Oh, such a slow boat. What this? Oh, this time. Oh, this time I'm playing as Kira. Oh, well, that's good. She was just outside the music room when she heard a piano. You guys, if you guys hear a piano playing, just don't go come closer, please. Just don't go investigate it. We're just going to. We're just gonna get close or something. She knew something was wrong, but she could not hear. Let she step inside. Down, just like many people. Yeah, down. So dark. The lights won't turn on. The silence covered the room. She knew something was wrong and decided to leave. But right when she got the door, the slam shut on her. Just seconds later, the eerie that silence returned. The music room is some noisy and lively during the day, but no one can pick it with nicely. Absolutely no one. Mom said the room turned into a sea of blood. She freaked out. It has begun. I'm gonna get her in bed as soon as possible. Whoa. She tried to break the door up about all her efforts seemed futile and then she screamed as if there was someone at school to hear her scream. But all this grew darker. 
She then realized there was nothing she could do. Suddenly, she remembered what made her into the darkness. She slowly made her way to the piano. What's that? Candle. Grab it. Nothing. She felt hopeless. She wanted to get up, but she did not know what to do. She thought of the things, then tried to open the door again. The hell? Everything's numbered. Huh? What is that? A notebook. It fell from above. The light's back. Just as I thought. There's a huge hole under the sea. The book must have fallen from there. It looks like an escape room. But it's supposed to be I need to get something to help me reach it. This table's too low. I can never reach the hole with this. The piano is too heavy to move. A candle. It's not high enough to help me reach the hole. Then what then? A candle. How do you? Um, huh. I'm, I really don't know what to do. Can't use the chairs. God damn. I'm clicking everything. How about this notebook? Can't you read it? Read the book. Please, read, read the book. But get to the chair, the chair, a candle. The table's too low. I can never reach the hole with this. Wait, I can stay the four tables and the four chairs to climb up. How come I only thought of this now? <laughs> Fuck. Oh. Oh. What? All right, let's climb. Oh no, it's too dark. I can go step down. Ah. Okay. What? Who is that? What are you doing here? No. Which class are you in? No. Hey. No, no. What the hell is going on? No. No. No, things got stranger by the minute. She panicked. The resounding unknown student scream took away what was left to close composure. A piercing scream inside of me. What? And then fear won. It took over her, leaving her with only one shot, one in one. And hope the whole find out if it's there. Huh? <laughs> oh, she fell. In the end, she fell. One of the gossips even said when she died, King of! Someone was there silently watching the blood ooze out of her lifeless body. Nothing is clear about the school. The lack of clarity can easily maddened me. I thought that I could suppress my fear if those things happened to me. Then I realized anyone can suppress their fear, but not many can overcome. Something's happened to me. The light is gone. No, 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 no. He still hasn't returned. Chapter 3 is not what it seems. I'm gonna end this video, please. Alright, guys. I'm gonna end this video. If you want more, subscribe.